No classic car event is complete without a field of priceless Duesenbergs and Bugattis, but the 2013 Amelia Island Concorde Elegance had a few offerings for those whose tastes are a bit more eclectic. One of the most interesting specimens we spotted was the Shark Roadster. This is a car that I've had for 32 years, a car that I found in Clearwater, Florida back in 1980, actually discovered it in 1979, begged the owners to sell it through 1979 and 80, saved up 355 bucks at the time, and was able to, uh, to purchase it, and restored it originally back in 1980-81. This is its first major show in nearly 50 years. In fact, it's only major show in 50 years. Henry uh, Covington designed the Shark back in 1959 and 60. It was a car he built, designed and built in um, St. Petersburg, Florida, and it was designed originally for a Porsche 356 or Renault or any rear engine lightweight car that you could take the body off of and then replace it with a fiberglass, a fiberglass body built in the way Henry designed it. In the end, six roadsters and six coupes were produced. Hacker owns the only known surviving coupe, plus two surviving roadsters, and one roadster body. He restored this shark for the first time back in 1981, but the end result didn't look anything like it does today. We were given the opportunity to present this car at Amelia Island this year in 2013. Then I, that opportunity came last fall, and when we that was about October, so that was five months. The first month or two, we tried to figure out if we could do it. The first month was spent planning, second in designing, and the last three months, 90 days, we've spent all in the restoration. This paint is only eight days old, maybe nine days old. The interior is four or five days old. It's one of the freshest restorations on the, on the ground. You can still smell the paint in the heat, which is actually kind of interesting. Under all this fiberglass sits a Renault 4CV chassis. The engine originally came from the same car, but Hecker has since replaced it with the more powerful Renault R10 engine and a modern four-speed manual gearbox. For the show itself, we decided to use period correct gauges, but actually reface them for the, for the model car it was. And in these cases, we actually used uh, an MG gauge as the body and then redesigned the face to reflect the kind of design that we wanted to with the Shark. This, these were custom made, the, the bezel that the gauges fit into, along with the, uh, the little Shark symbol was actually from the Shark division of uh, the submarine fleet of Russia and I had that source from Croatia after looking far too long for something that would be appropriate, a nice little shark symbol. It's a very friendly looking car. It has very inviting lines and features. It's an open car, so it's easy for people to see. We've had people inside of it all day. So this year's class we're presenting is called What Were They Thinking? I had to look over there to get it. What Were They Thinking is the class, and we're honored to be here as part of that, and if they have another class with another name like that, we'll be, we'll be here in spades as well. Catch all the latest auto enthusiast news at AutoWeek.com, in AutoWeek magazine, and iPad edition. Talk with us on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter at AutoWeek USA.